Hello, everybody, and welcome back to another episode on Mindcrack. Have you ever, uh, have you ever wondered what this intro would look like if you were standing behind me? Now you know. Hey, everybody, we are here on the Mindcrack server, and the fish, the fantastic fish, which I still have not named, I still haven't found the perfect name for it. Thank you for all your suggestions, but I am way too picky. Uh, it's finished! We finished the fish. That's what the title of this episode is going to be called. Finished fish. I put prizes on everything, and I want your opinions. I put, uh, 32 fish. Fish take a long time to get, okay? So keep that in mind. Okay? 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 Here's some fish. 32 of them. So that's a diamond. 32 fish is a diamond. There's no auto fish. I mean, there, you could AFK fish, but there's no, like, fi like factories for fish like there are for chickens. Uh, here's some salmon. Same same deal. Clownfish, though, I have very few of. Incredibly few clownfish. Which is weird, because they're not really used for much, if I remember. I mean, except for, like, funny potions. Because they're clowns. <laughs> Anyway, uh, puffer fish can be used for uh, water breathing. You get 16 puffer fish for a do for a diamond for a dollar for a diamond. I think that is the best deal in the whole place. Look at them go around and around, all around town. Boop. Then for the building blocks, these are a little expensive. I think I want your opinions on the. Oh, by the way, all of these prices. Let me know. Are they too expensive? Too inexpensive? What do you think? Prismarine here, you'd get 32 for a diamond. It's a tiny bit stingy, I think. Because I use a lot for this house. It's tiny. I think I'm being a little bit greedy on the blocks. The problem is, is that I have to go farm them. I have to go spend time and get them. And then sea lanterns are really expensive because they're really hard. And there's not many that grow. And they look so cool. Now, sponges this is a great buy, I think. You get eight sponge block. Oh, I keep forgetting. This trap door, this is a trap chest. I'm not changing it. But every time you open it, the trap, the trap door goes off. I want to fall. Why am I not falling? There we go. Anyway, it's kind of funny. Um, yeah, so anyway, you get eight sponges for a diamond. And people will pay me here. I should probably have uh, some secret thing going back here. Um, but anyway, that is the fish store completed. I am so happy with how this turned out. I know that we spent like four or five episodes on it. Daily episodes on building out the fish shop. But the inside looks great, I think. Uh, I ended up cleaning. Ah, get me out of this door. Um, I ended up cleaning out the front here. The uh, the chests are gone. Let's uh, sleep for just a little bit. And wake up! Let me see. Do I have any... Huh. It would be great to put maybe some flowers, some green flowers in front of this. Or, let me see. I was wondering if there's anything else we could do to gussy up, to fancy up the outside just a little bit. Probably get rid of some of these torches, but... Oh, hi, spider. Um, hmm. Hi, spider. I don't think so. Not quite yet. We might do something later. Maybe add some vines or something. Once we kind of get some more shops in here, might figure this out. I need to talk to good old Adlington and say, yo, man, you need to build your place. Your, uh, minecart house. Thing. That'd be great if we could get that built. No, it's not. It's not his fault. I'm saying it like, oh my gosh, you've been neglecting me. I've been, I've been sending you messages. Yeah, that's not how it happened. Um, but yeah, I like the fish. The fish is finished. <laughs> I want to alliterate so much with this fish. Uh, that's a bad angle because you can see both eyes. He looks crazy mad from that angle. Um, 
uh, we cleaned up the bottom here. So there is still a pond under here. See? See that pond? Um, do I have any torches? Oh, I do. Let's We can torch this up just a little bit more. Um, there we are. I think that's good. I have so many torches down here. Basically, I just don't want anything ever to spawn ever in here. They're not going to spawn over there. There's just, just one, one block tall. But anyway, there's that. And... Um, looking good. Okay, so I am gonna head off. We are we are going um, to. Oh, I want to christen this. How do I christen? Ooh, how can I christen this? Oh, I have an idea. Okay, I'll be right back. And we're back. And we have a splash potion of water breathing. I now officially announce you, the fish store. Open. Oh, I didn't get any water breathing, but it has been christened. And it is now open to the public. We have to do one more thing to really make this quite official. I'm going to teleport over. By teleport, I mean use into pearls. Uh, over to spawn. And let the rest of the people playing on this server know. Oh, oh, oh dang it. I was hoping that that would lay me on top of the roofed forest. But uh, that didn't work out so hot. Oh, uh, is that a weird? F what is this? Good work. You found Lord Helmet. Your RV is here. Oh, this is uh, I think Anders um, pranking generic B with a goose chase round. Are those coal blocks? Oh my gosh, that is. Gosh, that is expensive. That is that is one expensive statue. Uh, we're trying to get back into spawn. Let's see if we can. Nice. That was a good throw in between those trees. Yeah. And down here, we shall let people know. Shop village. New. Oh yeah. Look at that. Licensing agency, docs shop, pyromancers guild. It's time to let people know. Okay, now we have to name it. Uh, the the flabby fish. Store. <laughs> store. Store. The Flabby Fish Store. No. Open. To the. Open. Open. Maybe it should just be open. Get your fish. Fish stuff. Oops. Here. Get your fish. Capital fish. Don't know why that's. Get your fish stuff here. Fish. 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 Fish stuff here. Why is stuff capitalized? <laughs> stuff here. There we go. I should probably be in quotes, but I'm not going to put that. I'm not going to delete all that. There we go. Flabby Fish F Store is now open for business. I'm, I've am i been trying to clear away the Adlingtons. Anytime I notice one. I have, I've gotten rid of at least 23 heads so far. Um, the Flabby Fish F Store is open for business. And happy, I am so happy about it. Okay, I'm going to go find something else to do on this server here. Okay, we are here at the house. And last night on stream, I did a little bit of work in the kitchen area. Uh, this is the kitchen. 
and um, I did some stuff, but I realize now that this isn't quite perfect or quite right. Basically, I put down this table. We designed this table, and it's simple. It's incredibly simple, but I like it. Um, I like, I mean, it's very rustic, and I would assume that a one of these modern houses would almost have a really, really rustic um, table in it for some reason. I don't know why that, that struck me is that that would be what happens, but that is uh, how I felt it should be. But this is in the wrong location. This, I've... And I actually thought, I think I said this in uh, one or two videos, is that that, I thought that was going to be the table, and then this was going to be like a, a more elegant table? I don't know. Uh, but actually, that is an island. That is a uh, an island for the... Um, for the kitchen here. In fact, that needs to be cut out as well. Um, so let me replace let me take that out that's the start here's the end and I'll pull this stuff out and then we will reattach it over here now this is gonna be a smaller table now because our the room that we have is much smaller um, but that'll give us like basically one open spot for a chair and a few ch a few chairs around here and then I can pop this right back down to be its placeholder. And what I think I'm going to do is something I've never done uh, with blocks before, uh, or at least I haven't, I haven't done it quite yet. I'm going to go back to the wood. Here, let's grab some of these. I want to grab little bit of that and a few of these actually let me also grab hmm, some of those I want to experiment with a look on this oh I don't have any let's also assume that right here and here they're not them now but let's assume that that is a stove and over on this side, what I would like to try to do is see if we can make this. Oh, that doesn't look good because that is the same color as the floor. What I would love to do, let's pull this in. There we go. And... I'm thinking, let me think, uh, oh, I wish I had, I want the white stained clay. Come here. There we go. I don't need, to, I'm going to just get rid of a few things that I, I don't need. There we go. Let's get rid of this. There we are. And I don't know if these are going to look like stools or not. Ooh, they attach. I really wanted those to look like bar stools. They sort of do. They just seem like gigantic bar stools. Hmm. Hmm. Part of me wishes that I could do something or it goes in the ground. Now that's going to look weird too. Okay. I was thinking about maybe uh, working on the level of uh, of this. I don't really think those look like bar stools. Do you? I gotta admit. Not really convinced of the bar stool look here. 
I mean, maybe from a distance, but the moment you get up to it, it's like, who would ever, who would ever be able to get on top of that, uh, to serve that? And then that just kind of is weird for this over here, which I th think it needs to be some sort of step. Let let's just sketch this out. There we go. And let's just keep this the same. That doesn't look too bad, actually. Um, right here is going to be a refrigerator. And I will need to get some iron doors for that. I'm out of uh, out of those iron pieces. Ooh, is that enough? Yes, because we get multiple doors nowadays. Not just a single iron door, but we get three. Thank you, Minecraft developers. There we go, and that's our little fridge. And you know what? We have the technology to make sure that those become furnaces. So let's go grab some furnaces. We have the technology. Here we are, we already have two furnaces. And I wanted to try something. I wanted to make, uh, I'm gonna need some more iron. There we go. I don't need all the iron, but a little bit of it. So let's take the furnace. Drop them down. Those look nice. Let's make another pressure plate. Of course, look at that. Fancy, fancy. We will need some sort of flu. Um, oh, by the way, I didn't even show this off, but check out our... Um, <laughs> this is one of the coolest things that we made was cabinets cabinets up here um, To get into I hear some sort of zombie um, I am I'm liking the kitchen so far. It's kind of a little bit built out um, We need a few things we need a sink so we'll have to put a sink in here I would like to make a crafting table and put it somewhere in here. Wait a second, I just had a grand idea. Where is this zombie? There you are. Okay, this might take a little bit more. Whoops, get out of here. Oops, do we think that looks at all like a... No, that looks horrible. That looks so bad. I am embarrassed. It might be nice, though. Come back here. Man, that was fast. Um, hmm. Is if you open this up, and then there's crafting tables. That could be neat. We'd have to add more. Let's just do the rest of these. Bam. <laughs> I don't know why, but I like it. So we reach up there to craft whatever we want. Let's make a cauldron because we'll need a sink. There we go. Uh, we will need a lever or possibly, uh, oh look, we also throw the items that we uh, need over, over there. Um, 
I don't know why I have a blue orchid. Let's put back the jungle planks that were right here. And we do need some sort of flu system right here. Otherwise, this is just going to look quite weird uh, with the putting down temporary torches as well. Um, I don't know, with a stove that's right there. I don't know, a little bit of, uh, we spent a lot of time actually on this, um, on this kitchen and dining room area. But I like it. I also like that you open this up and you get some crafting tables out of it. We will need to crafting table this right on up. There we go. Do we see this? Oh, yeah, we see all of it. We see it. Oh my gosh, I'm trying so hard. Stop jumping, just place it. There we go. This pantry might uh, might be better if we cover this up sort of like that. Maybe add some glowstone in here. Let's get, let's put away the, uh, we don't actually need quartz as badly as you may think, but we do want some glowstone. And also, I really want sandstone. There we go. Oh my gosh, zombies, the zombies are real. Let's knock those two out, and let's put glowstone here. There we go, and here is a nice little pantry area. And uh, that's nice because that's a transparent block. We can put chests in there, and they'll open just fine. Okay, well, that's going to about wrap it up for this episode on Mind Crack. Thanks so much for watching. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. It's a rather long episode. I'm pretty positive. And I will see you next time will most likely be tomorrow. See you then. I'm walking all over the counters. I gotta learn how to stop that. Bye-bye!